That is one hot-tempered son of a bitch. find out who's been overseasoning the soup in this place. LAPD. Who owns this factory, ma'am? Mr. Parnell. Howard Parnell. I'll let him know you're here. Please, take a seat. If you don't mind, we'll come with you. If you must. You just wanted to follow her, didn't you? You sly dog. I must apologize for my partner's roving eye. He hates saying goodbye, but he loves watching them leave. Give it a rest, Roy. If you could show these men in to see Mr. Parnell, Doris, they're from the LAPD. Follow me, gentlemen. What is going on? LAPD, sit tight, fatso. You could be in very serious trouble. There's no reason to be rude. Take a seat, gentlemen. I'm sure we can sort this all out. Maybe you can explain why we found $5 bags of marijuana in sealed Parnell soup cans. That's an outrageous allegation. How do you explain it, Chubby? We found at least 30 cans, all sealed up tight with your label on it. Can I get a list of your employees? Of course. We have nothing to hide. Doris, can you bring me in the current employee listing? Here it is, Mr. Parnell. On the desk, please. Any name on that list that rings a bell? This is familiar. 1452 North Las Palmas. A Jorge Garcia Cruz. How are your sales, Mr. Parnell? Just fine and dandy, son. We're entering a new era of prosperity. I hope you're both big soup eaters. The dope leaves here, Parnell. Your new prosperity won't mean much when the papers hear that this place is a cover-up for a dope operation. Son, that is a scandalous allegation. We fed the army during the war on products and here, and we were proud to do so. The factory sealed cans we found suggest a very professional operation, Mr. Parnell. We're looking for an inside man. I know nothing about this. I want this stopped as much as you do. You must suspect someone, Mr. Parnell. Are you sure it isn't someone who stole some of my labels? That would be pretty easy to do. Don't run off, detective. I'm counting on you to straighten this out. Ever heard of Juan Garcia Cruz? Not that I know of. He has a brother employed here. You know him? We employ large numbers of Mexicans. I'm not familiar with them all. He has the same address as his brother Juan, who we shot dead less than an hour ago. You better give me some. Look, I'm not involved in this. I'm getting enough grief from Washington. There's an investigation going on into profiteering. Like a guy shouldn't be able to turn a buck while the war is on. I'm sure thousands of dead Marines sleep soundly knowing that you did okay. <laughs> Tell us about Jorge Garcia Cruz. Jorge? I have no idea of his last name. His team does daily maintenance on the conveyor belts and cookers.
You're being made a patsy by a dope ring, Parnell, and you're happy to sit here and let it happen. You want my help? I said I'd help. You want to call me names? You can go fuck yourself. I tried to help, but every word I say gets twisted. I'm going to talk to my lawyer, kid. You can work this one out on your own. Show us to the factory floor. Now, hold on a second. You expect to storm in here, throw around a bunch of accusations, and then get a guided tour. Bingo. Let's go, fat boy. I hate seeing how things are made. This is going to be like that time I went to the slaughterhouse and couldn't eat steak for a week.